What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and today I want to talk about the new operation coming to Call of Duty Black Ops 4, and today on the PlayStation 4, when you load up Black Ops 4, you're greeted with this message on screen that reveals the name, and it's called Absolute Zero, Operation Absolute Zero. Now, also today, we were greeted with pretty much every piece of information that's going to be coming for this new operation, and man, I am super, super excited excited guys so first off here of course we are going to be getting a new specialist and that new specialist is called zero and the description says a versatile and deadly hacker available in both multiplayer and blackout In multiplayer zero can disrupt and distract her enemies using the powerful hacking tools at her disposal bringing new counteractive measures to the table in black ops 4 Players can unlock Zero by completing Tier 1 in the newly revamped Black Market and immediately start testing out her wonderful new toy. So, Zero is going to be the new specialist, which is just absolutely crazy. Like, her her character as a whole is, looks, it looks very, very interesting. And, of course, the ability she has. I just cannot wait to use her. Now, we also are going to be getting three earnable multiplayer weapons, and uh, the weapons are called the Daemon 3XB, which is an SMG, and then the SWAT RFT Assault Rifle, and then the Secret Santa Melee Weapon. And alongside this, we're going to be getting new weapon camos, reactive camos, and reticles to unlock along the way, so that's really, really cool. And then players can also immediately get their hands on these new weapons in Blackjack's Gun Game, one of our featured multiplayer playlists starting next week on PlayStation 4 and throughout Blackout Weapon Drop. So that's pretty exciting, guys. And then also they say here, watch out for more featured multiplayer playlists throughout the rest of the year, as well as our new holiday event starting December 13th on PS4 with new seasonal items to unlock. So that's going to be amazing. They are probably going to come out with a new trailer for this new holiday event sometime next week I'm pretty sure and then uh, we do have some more details on the evolution of the black market and uh, just a bunch of new and exciting stuff coming so um, next up for blackout here they do say on December 10th we're setting the stage with severely hotly anticipated updates to the core blackout experience for all platforms including our new armor repair system audio improvements SDM and Spitfire weapon balancing two of my favorite weapons of blackout are gonna get probably nerfed to heck man and seasonal changes across the entire map and by seasonal changes I'm pretty sure they're gonna be adding like maybe you know holiday themed um, events or holiday themed decorations around the blackout map for example Christmas lights or maybe even snow so that sounds very cool and then they say here players will immediately notice the map's new visual updates as soon as they jump out of the helicopter and they also say there will be some subtle environment improvements to Nuketown Island, Hydro Dam, and Factory. So I assume these spots or these locations are going to get like a Christmas theme redesign. Like for example, there's going to be Christmas lights hanging on some of the houses on Nuketown or something along those lines. But they also say watch out for our patch notes with more details on these updates next week. And then we turn things up a notch on December 11th when Hijack debuts on PlayStation 4 as our newest blackout destination located on the peaceful waters of the map's northwest quadrant. Inspired by the classic Treyarch map, our favorite luxury yacht becomes everyone's new favorite hot drop in blackout. So of course, Hijacked is going to be coming. We all kind of knew this pretty much earlier in the week, but there's also going to be a new vehicle and it's called the ARAV Armored Vehicle and it comes with a mounted turret machine gun. And yeah, that sounds really, really awesome. I cannot wait to use that vehicle. Um, they also say here, players can also drop in a zero after unlocking her or as one of the four zombie killing gladiators from nine after finding and completing the brand new set of blackout zombie character missions. So um, zero is gonna be used for blackout and then you can unlock the nine zombie characters. And then they go on to say here, we're also amping up our collection of personalization items that can be used in blackout in the new and approved black market including new unlockable blackout characters new epic specialist outfits shared war paints and more personalization items to use in the world of blackout that has been something i've complained about for many weeks now i feel there should be more customization within blackout 
and we are finally going to be getting that and also we're going to be getting custom games in blackout which has also been something we've wanted for quite some time now so this just opens up the door to many 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 different possibilities for example like more competitive events for blackout like esports events for this game and yeah i cannot wait guys um also reading on here they say weapon camo stash interface updates on console holiday map decorations throwable snowballs new seasonal special event tiers in-game promo gameplay improvements and more so blackout sounds just absolutely amazing guys um multiplayer 2 we're just going to be getting so much content for these two modes and of course also with zombies but you guys know i'm primarily a multiplayer guy on the channel but i will have the full um, blog post down below in the description for you guys in case you guys want to go read that up on zombies I'm not going to talk about that in this video But it's there if you guys want to go read that within the next part of the blog post They talk about how the black market is going to be revamped for the launch of operation absolute zero And so yeah, it's pretty much just a bunch of Christmas theme items coming And then the initial tier showcase is going to go from 200 to 100 and every reward for the first 100 tiers can be previewed in the black market right off the bat and uh, there of course is going to be new weapons like i said the daemon 3xb smg the swat rft assault rifle and the secret santa melee weapon um so yes there are going to be new specialist skins um mastercraft weapons they say the abr 223 mastercraft weapon is going to be coming out as well plus new blackout characters like i said earlier and so yeah just a lot of stuff is coming to the black market guys and so yeah just pretty much it's they're making it really hard for me not to say don't buy cod points because i've said many many times in previous videos do not buy cod points yet but after all of these new changes guys they're making it very hard for me to keep holding on to my cod points um but we're gonna have to wait and see what happens guys i'm still not 100 percent sold on this new um black market changes and just everything they they say in here we're gonna have to wait and see what happens guys but um, so yeah, and now moving on to the competitive season um, Unfortunately uh, League play is going to be delayed until early 2019 They do say that they've delayed it because they want to keep working on it and make sure that it's getting you know the proper care and uh, Just stability for the game mode, which I'm totally okay with I know a lot of people may be upset about that But as long as the game mode runs smoothly, then that's fine um, Gauntlet and clans and teams are also going to be delayed for early 2019 19, um, which sucks though like I said but as long as they all run smoothly that's all I care about so this was a really really huge blog post by Treyarch guys and it's something I feel that needed to be done because Fortnite just came out with a pretty awesome update earlier this week and uh, so Treyarch just completely responded back and said hey you know look at our stuff that we're going to be adding to blackout and multiplayer I'm pretty excited guys I cannot wait for 2019 as well um, all of this stuff again is going to be coming out on December the 11th next week so make sure you download the update and hop on during that week so uh, let me know your thoughts about this down in the comments what are your thoughts about the new specialist and the new operation I'm kind of thinking maybe they're going to be adding a new specialist weapon every time there's a new operation like um, Operation Zero of course kind of correlates to the specialist character Zero So maybe if they do something similar to Rainbow Six Siege where there's a, where there's a new operation Maybe there's a new uh, character that comes out. I don't know. We're gonna have to wait and see what happens about that but um, so yeah guys again tell me your thoughts drop a like on the video if you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching till next time I'll see you guys later